there's so many times where I look at my closet and I have so many clothes and I just never know what to wear. So I'm gonna show you guys a couple quick tips that I use to figure out what outfits to wear when I feel like I have nothing to wear. video is going to be what to wear if you don't know what to wear. <laughs> Definitely let me know in the comments section which outfit you guys like best and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and click on the subscribe button if you guys would like to see more videos like this and yeah let's just get into it. <laughs> so if you ever feel like you have nothing to wear just throw on a big tee like this one and I always wear some high-waisted pants with it and then just tie it in the front kind of bunch it together, twist it around my finger, and then I knot it, a nice little knot. It like really accentuates your waist, it makes you look, I feel, super cute. Yeah, I like this look a lot. And then usually I'll try to add like a jacket over top, like this one. This is just a denim jacket. Whenever I wear denim on denim, I try to wear different colors of denim. So this is a little bit darker, this is a little bit lighter. If you can see the two tones next to each other, I will link my how to wear denim video right here if you guys need to know how to wear denim and you have yourself a look. And this also works with a black tee as well or a gray tee. I'm gonna show you what that looks like in just a second. And this is the plain black tee. You can see that it's just literally a plain black tee and I tie it up here just the same as I did the other one. And then you can either wear like the same denim jacket over top or a different jacket. I'm gonna show you what it looks like with another jacket. Here's what it looks like with the leather jacket if you wanna go a little bit more like cool girl, I guess. So yeah, that is the first outfit so you can figure out what to wear when you don't know what to wear. <laughs> like I said, this outfit can literally be done with anything you can use like a black top and a leather jacket. You can use a corduroy jacket and a brown top, a pattern shirt, kind of like the one I used, and a denim jacket, or you can use a green jacket and a gray top or a green top and a camel top. Like it's literally endless. So this outfit is one that I use all the time when I don't know what to wear. My second outfit that I wear when I don't know what to wear is a big oversized sweater. The way that I style it is I usually put it off the shoulder and then I will tuck in the front. As it starts to get warmer, I trade the big sweater out for tees that are like button up tees and I'll show you how I style that. But this is just how I would style like an off the shoulder sweater. And it's like literally any, almost any sweater that you have can be turned into like an off the shoulder sweater and it just makes your outfit look a little bit more cute and I don't know, like put together and I really like it. And it's a perfect, like, I don't know, chill outfit that you could wear with friends, but also look super cute. If you don't know what to wear, it's perfect. So I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like with the button up that I keep off the shoulder. So for this one, it's a little bit different. This one is literally just a plain button up shirt. When you look at it from the front, it kind of looks boring and plain. But the way that I style it is a little bit different and I feel like it's kind of edgy and cute. I unbutton the front. So I take it off both shoulders and it makes it really cute. You can tuck it in the front and I feel like it just adds like a lot of personality to the outfit and makes it really cute. I love off the shoulder tops. And so like you saw, it was literally just a plain like button up shirt, but when I tuck in the front and take it off the shoulders, it's really cute and kind of edgy. And then you can also, if you don't wanna tuck it in the front, you can just tie the front again. I just kind of get tired of like tying all my tops all the time, but you can tie it. And the way that I would tie it is I would take the two bottom pieces that are separate and tie them together instead of doing like that knot that I did before. And that looks cute too if you wanna tie it. This is the second look. This outfit is another outfit that you can wear if you don't know what to wear. I typically go with like a sports tee, but you could go with like a graphic tee, um, something with like words or something cute on the front. And 
I'm gonna show you guys how I style it to look like really cute. Typically, I will tuck it in, and this outfit is honestly all about the accessories. So it really like depends on how you accessorize yourself, but I'm gonna show you what I typically do when I just wear like a regular tee. I tuck it in and kind of pull it out in the front a little bit. So that's, this is cute, but it's not quite there yet. So I'm gonna show you what I do to make it like super cute. You can see that I have my Michael Kors bag here and then I have three bracelets on my wrist. I have these glasses on, I have these earrings and then I have this choker on and I think it's super cute. It would even like look really cute with a belt bag. I think it would look a little bit better if it were like a black um, belt bag that were like actually meant to go around like your chest area. But yeah, so this is a look and this is how you can turn like an ordinary outfit into something that's super cute. Okay, I'm gonna show you the next and final outfit for what to wear when you don't know what to wear. The last and final outfit for what to wear if you don't know what to wear is an easy one. Just grab something out of your husband, your boyfriend, your dad's, your grandpa's, some men's shirt and style it. So this is a big T and the way I like to style this is to once again tie it in the front. I think that's like the cutest way to do it. I feel like it, the outfit just needs a little bit of like something to add to it. So I'll show you the bag that I would wear with it. This is how I would style it. And I would probably wear some like big chunky white sneakers with it and have these high waisted jeans. Yeah, this would be the look. And I feel like the best way to wear big men's tees is to wear like creams or whites or something that is like, I don't know, like a, a pretty muted color, nothing that's like neon or like, crazy colors, which I guess you could, but I feel like when they're big tees like this, like when you use like the basic classic colors, it just looks so much better. So yeah, this is how I would style this top and I really like it. All right, you guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I definitely wanna hear what you guys' favorite outfit was and if it was like a new way to style it. If you learned something new in this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. I would love that. And I would love it if you would subscribe to this channel if you guys wanna see more videos like this. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.